I would take Mauricio, you know, in a boat, in a, anywhere. Like I was going to do the whole, like on a plane, on a train. Out of all the ladies of Salt Lake City, who is the life of the party and why? Jen Shaw. Yeah. She just brings it. Like everything is over the top and random. Like you can't go skiing without her having a bag of props. Like literally she shows up at my office and all of a sudden I have new decor. I see Jen's a lot of fun. I say me or Jen Shaw because we just have fun. We just have a great time and I live in the moment and I love to live in the moment. And I never turn down a party ever. <laughs> so I like to have a good time. Heather. Because she's like, she's funny and she just, she, you know, she's like up and uh, she's kind of like witty and funny and I don't know, she's just, she can be silly and fun. Yeah. All right, out of the cast, who is the best and the worst Mormon? We're all the worst Mormons. The best Mormon is probably Lisa because she defends it vehemently. Mm -hmm. I don't know, I would say I'm the best Mormon, even though I'm 2.0. Um, and then the worst Mormon, I don't know. I don't know if any of the other girls are Mormon, so I don't even know if we'd be worried. Which housewife would you call to bail you out of jail and why? Lisa Barlow, mm -hmm. because I've known her forever and I know she wouldn't let me sit and rot in jail. Bethany. She's not current, but like, you know, I think Bethany could break me out of jail and get me, you know, off and get it all. I mean, she could take care of business. Dorit Humphrey. <laughs> Yeah, no, I have a nice ride home. If you could pick a housewife from another franchise to come and join your show, who would it be? Right now, I would say probably Sonia Morgan or Leah. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Yeah, they're yeah. so fun. Stir it up and it'd be so much fun. I'd like to get them on the mountain. First thing that comes to my head, Lisa Renna. Um, you know, Emily from the OC used to have a house in Utah. Emily moved back to Utah. I should think she'd fit in amazing here. So that's a little trickier yeah. because I just started watching. Okay. Um, but I don't really know because I really am, I'm just learning. I mean, maybe Garcelle, I really enjoyed watching her this season. Out of all the Salt Lake City women, who is the best and who is the worst dressed? I like my style the most. I don't ever want to change it. So I definitely like my style the most. I don't know if everyone would say I'm the best dressed, but I like the way I dress the most. Mm -hmm. And then the worst dressed, I really have to say. <laughs> There's two. <laughs> it's a tie. <laughs> I'm going to say I'm worse dressed, and Jen and Mary are best dressed. Jen, Lisa, and Mary. Like, Lisa really is so fashionable. She's got a great, great eye, great style. Jen is over the top, so it's just visual, like, you know, and same with Mary. Mary can pile on more Chanel in a sitting, like, you know, than, I, than you can even fathom. I like I'd play strip poker with Mary because she'd never go down. She's got enough on. And I would, you know, they're all great. They all dress really well. Well, best is easy. I mean, I would definitely say Mary is the most fashionable mm -hmm. on the cast. That's kind of easy. Worst, I don't know if I'd say the worst, but the one who certainly I know cares the least would be Whitney. She's okay. she's just not that into fashion. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, I'll go with that. If you could swap husbands for a day, who would it be with? No one. My husband is everything. No. No one's getting him and I'm not getting anyone else's. <laughs> All right. <He's> not the <laughs> best. <laughs> well they somebody asked me this and I made a joke that it would be Don Gunvalson, but mm -hmm. that was just a joke. Like obviously Mauricio. I would take Mauricio, you know, in a boat, in a anywhere. Like I was gonna do the whole <laughs> like on a plane, on a train. If you were on a deserted island with one of the women, who would you want it to be? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> That's scary. Yeah. That's a really <laughs> scary one. I'm trying to think like who would be the most resourceful one. Sure. Mm -hmm. And knowing all these ladies and uh, how they if they like to live. My <laughs> God, I don't think. And I would be the I would be with myself. Okay. <laughs> Whitney, yeah, because she's just tried and true and always has a great attitude. Always positive. Can get shit done. Am I allowed to say that? And you know, and she's. She's got your back, you know, she's loyal.